All right, let's. Uh, we're gonna need more space on this one. So applying our exponent rules, the first thing I'm gonna have to do on this one is distribute that one fourth. So then I would have m to the power of two times one fourth, and then I'd have n to the power of one times one fourth, and all this is over m to the power of negative one half, n to the power of five eighths. So this gives me m to the power of one half, two times one fourth, n to the power of one fourth, all over m to the power of negative one half, n to the power of five eighths. So if I split these up, then I've got m to the power of one half minus a negative one half, and then I've got n to the power of one fourth minus five eighths. Now the m isn't a problem, because then I've got the one half plus one half, which would be one, and we don't usually show the one. And then I've got n, but I do need common denominators on this one. I'll multiply the four and the one by two, so that'd be n to the power of two eighths minus five eighths, which would be a negative three eighths. And if we only want positive exponents, then I've got m over n to the power of, uh, well now it'd be positive 3 eighths.